Charlie Cushain here to do another quick mod to this grill or griddle. It's a nice black stone grill that's a nice Teflon coated um, surface that I can clean up with a paper towel and I love it. However, I have one problem using this. So let's take a closer look. Okay, the one problem I do have with using this Blackstone beautiful grill when I'm camping is most long-handled spatulas like this, as you see, have sharp edges and they're metal. And they're not really designed for going over a coated surface like this. It would scratch it. And I don't ever want to do that. So today, I'm going to turn this one, which I found. It has a metal handle, and there's actually metal enclosed in silicone. You see the edge is really flexible. So, and it's perfect for this. It doesn't scratch it, but when you're cooking burgers and you're getting splattered, your hand is always getting at risk of getting splattered. I don't like that. So I'm gonna put a long handle on this spatula to make it easy to use. And, I'm going to use this old rake handle that I just got and I'm just going to cut it off and add the spatula. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing we have to do to start using this spatula is I want to keep the handle but not this rubber. So we got to cut this rubber end off the handle so we can attach right to this metal. I think what we're going to do is go to about here. Okay, to hold this piece in the handle, I was going to put screws and stuff, but I didn't want anything sticking out. So I'm going to put some epoxy on there and I'm going to use this Gorilla two-part epoxy. I'm just going to slather it in here and I'll worry about sanding it smooth afterwards. You can see this is not a fussy thing. <laughs> All right. Now let's push it in there. After this dries, we're going to fill in all the other cavities. So it'll be perfectly smooth when I'm done. Okay, now for a coat of stain, and I'm using Early American. There we go. Okay, the next thing we have to do is put some polyurethane on this. And I'm using, as usual, the Helmsman Spar Urethane. It's good for indoor and outdoor. So uh, this is nothing really fussy. I'm just putting a, a nice coat on the whole handle. That's coat number one. Okay, the next thing I want to do, now that the handle's all been polyurethaned, it looks beautiful, I sort of want to just cover up this joint. 
that I made just for looks and I have a piece of heat shrink tubing and I'm going to try to shrink it on just like that so let's try it perfect now you can't see where I made that joint well here's the final design came out beautiful that's glued on there really nice with this heat shrink covering up the joint it'll be good for flipping burgers and not scratching my grill I also added a leather lanyard to the end so I can hang it on my grill so all in all this came out perfect